Hey guys, Megan Duma here, your host at Wine for Blondes, and I am a self-admitted wine dork. And when I go out in the vineyards, I'm here in Pine Ridge Vineyard in uh, St. Helena, Napa Valley, and when I go out in the vineyards, I get really, really excited about their trellis training system. You go, every vineyard has a different kind, or not necessarily every vineyard has a different kind, but there are many different kinds of trellis training systems. And this one in particular is used often in France, in Burgundy and Bordeaux, and it's called the Open Lear System. And what it does is you split, you see the old, the old roots kind of right here and then where your new grapes are going to come is right here off of these spurs and these spurs have been pruned meaning they've been cut off and laid down along this training wire now what, th what this does is based on where this exact location and where the Sun is coming over the mountains behind us it will give enough Sun exposure to the berries to produce the optimal berry for these growing conditions and so it's just a kind of a, a cool you can see the contraption here it's like a it's like a, a, a torture trap <laughs> Uh, for the poor vines, but it really will create the best berry possible. The other cool thing about here is I'm standing um, where cover crop has actually been uh, mowed down. Now cover crop in the vineyard next to me you can see there's a, a t almost like a clover cover crop and this is planted um, this is planted in the soil and meant to be tilled into the soil to make sure that you're adding nitrogen and other nutrients to the soil to support your vines when they need the they need the nutrients to grow. Uh, another thing that you'll often see in the New World i.e. California, Australia, um, South America that you won't ever see not ever, they're starting to do it, but you won't traditionally see in the old world, is the irrigation system. Now the irrigation system is basically a hose that they run underground. You can see the irrigation system right here. And these little guys squirt out water. Now you want to make sure when you're putting your irrigation system in, you don't put it too close to the root. You want to make sure it's a little bit far from the root, so the root has to go out to pull in the water. And that makes the root go deeper into the earth and really get the terroir and nutrients that exist below the earth. So this is our open lear system. We're going to find out about more trellising systems because like I said, I'm a wine dork and I love it. So if you want to find out about our next trellising system, enter your email in the box right here to the right and I'll shoot you our next video with it.